you and MIA really put together some phenomenal stuff. You guys, right. you, you did Paper Planes, right? Which was uh, her her biggest song, right? That was her like breakthrough, and then that was kind of a record that carried her to mainstream, right? Because then then after uh, you know Kanye and Drake and, and Eminem, yeah. I used to got a Grammy because of the Kanye sample the. Um, Swagger Like Us, he sampled the, the vocal from there. Oh, so you get a Grammy if you get sampled? Because um, I, I wrote some of the lyrics on the record, so I was like sort of like oh. a writer on that record. Oh, um, so the hook? Yeah, so oh, like I that, that's something. Because I was, I, was, I was a writer on the record, so that one Best Rap Award, I got... I get, I, it's not really a Grammy, you get like a little medal. When you're like one of the loser <laughs> dudes that like has a writing credit on a Grammy record. But um, we're getting a Grammy this year, hopefully, with some... Maybe Climax or something. But if we don't get a Grammy, I'm all good. I'm, tra I'm happy just, you know winning Vlad TV's number one dude in the game award. <laughs> you and uh you and MIA were were dating at one point? Yeah, we dated for quite a while. For how long? Yeah. On and off probably like five years. Five years? Yeah. So after y'all met and started working in the studio then Probably about before her first album came out, um, up until her second album came out and then, you know, on and off, a little bit here and there. But um it was a real you know, it was a lot of on and off, like probably in those five years, I don't know how much time it was together, but we, we had a real good chemistry, like, you know, in the studio and, and away from it, because half of her music is in the studio and half of it is, uh, like, in the world and, like, in the, in the art, in the creative side and in the, in, the, in the attitude and stuff like that, so we got along really well making mixtapes and making videos and making ideas together, so. What, what uh, finally broke you guys apart? Um, it just, I think that we were, I was, it was, you know, it's impossible to date somebody in the, I feel like, in the industry, it's really, I mean, I, it's just, it's not easy, especially when we, when you were, like, very small, like we were, and it explodes, like, how it did with Hipper Planes, it became really difficult, um, but I feel like, uh, there's lots of is issues that we had personally between each other, but, um, but all, all that matters is that, you know, we had, like, what we did together was amazing, you know, yeah. that's all that really matters, you know, like, now, we both have our own relationships, you know, I have, a, I have a son, and, you know, she's engaged or something, I don't know what it is, but... Is she married? She's... I think she was engaged, I don't know what, what her relationship so she has, is. So she has a child, obviously. Yeah, she's she was child. pregnant during the yeah. Swagger Like Us performance. So she had, she had a child, but, um, yeah, we both, we just grew up, we were young back then, and, um, we were just making some crazy shit, like, we had no rules of what we were doing, the music, so it was exciting. 